All right, man, so look, we back at it again with another crazy video for y'all. Now, before we get into the video, I need y'all to do me a big favor. Go down below in the comment section and answer the poll question of the day. So today, poll question is, I got something slight. I got something slight for y'all, but what's your favorite flavor of ice cream? Me personally, I love some strawberry ice cream. I love strawberry, okay? Strawberry ice cream, well, even uh, cookie dough. Cookie dough ice cream be slapping. But y'all let me know what y'all favorite flavor of ice cream is. Without further ado, man, hit that like button, subscribe to our post notifications, follow your boy on IG, what is y'all doing? Follow your boy on IG. I mean, bro, it's free. If you don't have IG, make one for me, cause it's free, and I love you, and I love me. You know, you see, I'm rapping. But anyways, man, hit the like button. Let's get, let's go. Also, I got a podcast channel. Y'all want to subscribe? Go down below. It's all in. I don't know what I just said. Anyways, let's go. What's going on, gentlemen? Tonight is a moment for self-reflection matter of fact let's shed a little light on this subject I could have been a predator and I am a little sympathetic to R. Kelly I know that sounds really really crazy but hear me out did this man just say no, no, I'm not hearing you out. I'm not hearing you. You cannot back up what you just said. This, I'm a little sympathetic to R. Kelly. I mean, you said it with so much just ease. And not even that. The first part you said was I could have been a predator. What type of mess? No, I can't hear you out. I can't hear you out. You can't back that. There's no way you can back that up. There's no way you can seriously back that up. I guess I need to start with what I've done. Oh Lord. When I was doing my Craigslist protocols, hot and heavy, I would get a ton. I mean, a ton of high school girls answering my ads. And typically I ignored them because even though I have a similar appetite to R. Kelly. I like young women. Hey there, my boy. Why did I just click on this video? Seriously, this is my first time watching this video, and I mean already, we only like one minute, two minutes, I don't know how many minutes we in. We about like 50 seconds in the video. And he already, I have a similar appetite to R. Kelly? Did you just say you have a simpler, a similar appetite to R. Kelly? You like young women. No, 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 no. You like little girls. That, that's what you like. Young, little girls, not young women. Little girls. You have a similar appetite to argue. How can that even come out your mouth? How can you even say something like that? That's disturbing, buddy. That is disturbing. And the fact that you made a video and posted it on YouTube. I mean, when I seen a title... I didn't expect him to say stuff like this. I just seen I could have been a predator. And I was like, oh, so this might be interesting to watch. I mean, this is my first time watching it. And you already shocking me. And we only one minute and nine seconds in the video. I, I already know this is a video I'm not going to get through. Because I, I can't stand child predators. I can't stand grown men who like little girls. Uh, you nasty. Uh, huh. But I don't like children. No, no, no. No. But this is how a child tricked me. Oh. Typically, they would be young. There, there would be lots of signs that this girl was very, very young. And I would just ignore them. Then this one girl, she answered that. We started to talk. And she was an exceptionally mature 17-year-old. Let me say this again. This chick was 17. Her conversation was different. She actually was a hairdresser and she answered my ad and I fucked her. And oh my God, she had these amazingly firm double D titties. What the, what am I, I'm watching a grown man talk about some 17 year old titties. What is, what, what the, yo, yo, you, you gotta be, you gotta be dog doo dooing me bro. I'm watching a grown man, the, the the probably old enough to be my daddy. Let me not say it like that because I don't even know what he got in his mind. 
but probably old enough to be my father. And you talking about she got some double D titties and she was 17. You talking about 17 year old titties and you old enough to be her father. And you said it so like I effed her. What made you want to make a video about you having something? You is a filthy animal. And I hope that you're in jail. I hope and pray. That you in jail. You nasty dirt. Um, oh my bro. I'm gonna say some things. I, I I'm sorry. Look, I'm saved. I am I promise you I'm saved. But when it comes to things like this, because I think about it, I got a little sister. And if she ever tell me, now I will be mad at her for answering some stupid ad, but if she ever tell me like this grown man that could be old enough to be her freaking daddy did something sexual to her. Boy, I'm going to have to do a lot of praying. That should have been my clue. Because when she would lay on her back, they would stand up. And they were not fake titties. That should have been my clue. But, you know, I was caught up in the delicious pussy. And she did everything I wanted her to do. Then. Is y'all hearing the same thing I'm hearing right now? Are we on the same page? Look me in my face. We Are we hearing the same thing right now? Or am I tweaking? Am I tweaking or is you tweaking? This is not a good time to watch this. One of the things that I, could, I would do is I would do social media search on all my chicks just out of curiosity. So I'm like doing my social media search and I find her Facebook page and I see her with her high school friends. And I'm like, Oh, shit. So I call her up and I ask her because, you know, she told me she was 21. That's what she told me. And I was like, serious question. And at this time, I had fucked this chick 10, 15 times. And you cannot unfuck a chick. You can't unfuck her. So and I was out of the 10 to 15 times. You just once, you just finally decided, let me go look at her page. You know, as mad as I am, I can't be as mad because she lied about her age. She lied and said she was 21. So, I mean, at the end of the day, it's really her fault, but it's seriously like a question. Like, you nowadays, you have to ask women, what are, the, what is the age? You know what I'm saying? What are they age? Like, how old are they? You have to ask that because that should be your first question. Every time I talk to a female, my first question is, how old are you? Because I don't want to, because these women, they be they be about they be about 13, but you will think they 25. I mean, they be so mature. They they be having a makeup on. just And I be like, dang, how old is you? Oh, I'm 13 instantly. Oh, that's my clue to back it up, 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 back it up. Because I'm not doing that. No, no. I was like, I need you to tell me something. How old are you? And then she got very silent and she said, I'll be 18 in four months. Then she also said the age of consent in Georgia is 16. So you're good. And I'm like, so she comes over and we have this conversation because she was everything that I liked. I like women who 5'3", she was 5'2". She had huge titties, little waist, fat ass, pretty toes. She was my pro. The fact that you're still talking about what she had and you know she's 17, it makes me mad. Seriously, it does. I mean, you know that she's 17 and like, you know this now. And you're still talking about what she had. You're dirty. You're seriously dirty the type even though she was extremely young and you know what i kept doing i kept fucking her i'm done i'm done i'm done i'm seriously done i'm serious. mr robert where are you i'm watching a video right about a man talking about 17 year old titties and he's 35 he's 35 probably old enough to be your daddy robert and you're 40 and he's talking about 17 year old titties. You're 40 and he's about like 70. I don't know. He's, uh, he's almost your age. 
I gotta go back to film. This 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 is disgusting. It seriously disgusts me that this man is seriously sitting here talking about all of these type of things, knowing that she was seventeen. Okay, now he knows this and he say I still did did it with her after knowing that she was 17. The fact that you're so blunt to come on camera and say something like that, bro, you need seriously help. You need serious help, okay? Serious help. I mean, you seriously sit in this nice red red in interior car and you're talking about having something to do with a 17-year-old. A 17-year-old. And you say you still did it with her. Bro, you deserve to be locked up. I don't, you deserve to be locked up. I didn't know that you kept doing it with her. I thought maybe you would stop. You is filthy. You is filthy. Anybody who 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 looks at little girls, 17, knowing that, no, even if you didn't know her age to begin with. Okay, cool. That's her fault. Because she told you she was this age, but you went along with it and you did something with her. Okay, you got to pass. But then after knowing her age... You still talking about what she had. You still talking about all the all the physical qualities that she had. Forget the personality. I mean, you only talking about everything you liked in a woman. And she's 17. This filthy. I kept fucking her because I was like, at this point, I fucked her 15 times. And it was just like the crime was done. So I just kept fucking her from what? she was 17 to 22. You and R. Kelly and I are similar, but we're very different. No, because no. I have safeguards. I know when I'm getting out of control. I know when I'm getting out of control. And I kind of anal you know, ran analysis on this. And um, she was older. Her parents weren't breathing down her neck. And this is how a lot of young girls end up with older dudes. Their parents are not heavily involved in their lives. No. Where they have the time no. and the freedom to get away with this stuff. And her parents didn't check her. She'd go out. She'd spend the night out. Her parents were like, you know, she came home alive. Cool. Her parents were not on her. So I didn't have to worry about catching a charge from the parents. And once again, we just kept doing our thing. From 17 to 22. I fucked this chick for five years. And. Yeah, I'm done. I'm done listening to you bro. If y'all want to see the original video. Go ahead. Y'all can look up. I am. Y'all can look up. I could have been a predator. I'm done listening to this clown. I can't. That is disgusting bro. And I'm not even. I'm not even in front of my move. This video is 26 minutes long. I can't go 26 minutes long. Listen to a grown man. Talk about having something to do with a 17 year old. After knowing that she was 17. This is filthy. This is seriously filthy. This is trifling, bro. This is trifling. I don't care about finna. When I when, when I watch a video and I react to a video, if it if it gets weird like this, I'm cutting it off. I'm not finna keep watching this clown. This is dirty. This is seriously trifling, bro. And I hope you in jail. I pray that you in jail. You deserve to be in jail. You nasty. Oh man, you know what? Y'all let me know what y'all think about this situation in the comment section below. Y'all let me know. Um I'm lost for words. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this, man. Uh, I love y'all. Thank you for 60K. I appreciate every last one of y'all. 60K, thank you. I love y'all, boy. I love you. I love you. Yep, soon. I love y'all, man. God bless. Stay blessed. Peace. <laughs>